Hello, everyone. It's Religious Fanboy here again. And today we are discussing the Christian lessons and themes of Fight at Family Episode 8. As always, we are starting off with the passage of scripture for this video, which today is Ephesians chapter 4, verse 25, which says, Therefore, having put away all falsehood, let each one of you speak the truth with his neighbor, for we are members of one another. Um, just giving some helpful information. Me way of saying members of one another and giving some scriptural context to help unpack it. Um, the book of Ephesians is written by Paul. Well, is a collection of letters written by Paul to Christians in Ephesus, and they kind of give some context of what's being talked about in the book of Ephesus. There are similar things to the book of James, where it talks about principles of life, specifically in how we relate and are to interact with each other, especially our fellow believers, as is referring to here. And it says many of our members, this, this book is also where we get the concept of many parts of one body, viewing the church as a body, as the bride of Christ, and, or the body of Christ, both terms have been used. Um, and we also see this in talking about and when scripture in the New Testament talks about loving husband and child to love their wives. It says to love your wives for men to love their wives as Christ has loved the has loved the church. Um, and that's kind of where we get to where church tradition has gotten certain terms in regards to Christianity as the church being the bride of Christ. Um, I don't remember what song it is, but there's a contemporary Christian song that came out of watching this within probably seven years ago? I want to say around 2016. Okay, I'll Yeah, about six years ago. We'll say around that point in time. Um... Now I'm moving on to an episode summary. It's real quick sentence just because we're gonna be talking not much happens and what does happen we'll be talking about as we go through our talking points. Yuri meets his sister yours husband Loin for the and verbal conflict between the two quickly escalates. And the main message of this video is that lies create the foundation of conflicts, but can begin to but conflicts can begin to be resolved through on 
for being honest with one another. Um, and we see this illustrated to me the secrets that are specifically being kept from Yuri and how the lack of ex honest explanation for the situation leads to these conflicts and issues of having and the difficult situation of having to prove their love and their relationship through Yuri, through kissing, which we so see as an awkward situation for them, which does not help the conflict. Oh, excuse me. Um... The... I, I said excuse me because I, I accidentally burped it. Um, there, and now we're going through our talking points. And I, we tend to do often in our passage of scripture. Uh, we're just taking two or three quotes components of the Bible verse and using them as our talking points. Our first one, therefore having put away falsehood, the important, just emphasizing the importance of not lying to one another. In this episode, um, throughout the series so far, we've seen them feel the need to lie in order to do what is most efficient and and that is something that we face in our daily day. Um even simply there are times where we don't want to talk about what's going on and that there are a certain level of trust. But it is important that in our daily lives, that we have a group of trusted people that we can lean on when times get hard, that we don't feel the need to just lie and say that we're okay when we're not okay. Um, and whether that is and regardless of what God may be calling you to in regards to that aspect of your life, whether that be pursuing therapy, getting more plugged in with your church, um, or just getting to the point where you can have good Christian friends that you trust, and our prayers and calls and calling God puts on your heart to seek counsel from your friends. And if you are not in, or your family, and if you're not in an environment right now where you feel like you have those resources, I will pray for you and I hope pray that you're able to find that and that God puts you in the right direction to find that. Um, and my next talking point is that let each one of you speak the truth with his neighbor. And this good transition from what I just said, and we see this being important as this whole conflict having been able to be avoided 
by them just speaking to Yuri to help him understand the situation, even if it's not being fully open on the situation, at least get to the point where they can start to have that relationship where they can trust each other with these important situations. And I don't know what happened. I've only seen like two episodes nine. I haven't watched episode nine yet. But we can see that there is possibility based on what these three characters want and what they fight for that through Ami's communication they would be able to get to get, get along better and even help each other and protect each other. But because of them feeling the need to fly and feeling like they're not at that point where they can be honest to each other about what's going on, we have to deal with these concepts that arise when we are called out for lies. And when that happens, we can understand that that Things for a reason, and if we haven't repented of those lies when it escalates to this point, this is the time when we need to bring ourselves to have that those important conversations rather than trying to create new lies and hide behind them to avoid the difficult but much-need conversations in order to, for us as Christians, to fully function and properly function as the church and be the creation that God has made us and intended for us to be. And with that being said, um, hopefully that week will be smoother and easier to keep up with the upload schedule. And if you'd like to support what I do, what God has allowed me to do here, And encourage this ministry to keep going forward. I would appreciate subscribing here as well as you can follow us on Tik. Follow me on TikTok where I do similar videos that are a bit shorter in length. Um where we discuss manga chapters and the Christian lessons and themes in them. In a small, condensed, devotional time style video. And enjoy your day. Have a great rest of your week. God bless. And I will see you next time. Bye.